Aloha and welcome. Here we have a 2018 RAV4 SE. The vehicle appears to be in really good shape. Uh, only 10,000 miles on it, which is very cool. Uh, this is an SE model too, so it has a more sporty tuned suspension, better wheels, tires, uh, more blacked out features like a honeycomb grill, and uh, a few other little aggressive features kind of thing. Um, it's gonna be an 18, so everything has radars with it. The emblem, the windshield, uh, so you have pre-collision, lane departure, automatic high beams, and dynamic radar cruise control. Uh, fog lights for the vehicle, 176 horsepower, 2.5 engine, 25 MPGs average. You know, we're going to have these little marks that are vortex generators that reduce wind noise from the outside. Uh, turn signal indicator lights in the mirrors, blind spot monitoring on the mirrors. Body side molding, a little streak across the side. It's a $300 accessory, so that's good. Um, Yo, overall, yeah, it looks pretty good. Uh, you have a few more features back here, like probably a lift gate and a backup camera. All right. Nice, everything functions well. This is a certified vehicle, so it does have a warranty, um, which is great. I have a seven year warranty kind of thing, one year full coverage, mainly engine and transmission. All right, so all about the map of the vehicle, which is great. It shows people took care of the car. We want to look and see if the wheel wells are scratched up or if there's anything weird that uh, we have to live with kind of thing. They look really good. Just that mark right there kind of thing, but it's just magic. I just sharpie that to get rid of that thing. Um, this comes off. Sweet. And then your seats will fold to give you six feet of cargo. Um, all right, cool. Looks really good. Uh, back here we want to look for child seat indicators little marks in the back to see if there's kids back here their car seats but it looks clean looks like no one was back here looking at the roof no issues up there looks good and then again pushing that button the seat fold down flat you need about five and a half feet of cargo six with that passenger seat push forward all right, that looks pretty good. Uh, SE models have more like like a better trim going on too because they're higher trim level, a little more chrome blacked out stuff going on. That looks good back here. Looking for anything out of the ordinary. Um, you'll have Eco Sport normal mode. You'll have heated seats, dual climate control. Navigation traffic weather the whole nine yards, Bluetooth capabilities. You'll have that sunroof and uh, home link for the garage up here. You'll have a, uh, a center lock differential button. It's an all wheel drive vehicle, but if you get into a bad situation, you can push that and it'll get you out. Now, paddle shifters for the SE model, smart key technology, so push button start. Yeah, so on and so forth. All right, let's see how she sounds up. Good, sounds fine. Just out of gas. No weird idle, no weak idle, no whining. Nothing out of the ordinary, it's fine. So now we want to look over some more of the used features of a used car. So some things we want to look for is to see if there's any hail on the car, right? There appears to be no hail on this vehicle. We can also look on the aluminum trim see if we see any hail but it looks fine but it is cloudy here hail can be seen in different lights but nope, i'd say it looks good up here the vehicle's kind of in a globe trotter new york virginia uh, georgia and then here and those car packs no accidents no damage one owner kind of thing a um, little bit of misalignment here nothing dramatic i can put my side into this and Put a little adhesive in there overnight and that's how i fix my cars but a little bit of misalignment nothing dramatic uh everything looks fine here a little bit of misalignment so we also want to see if things feel weird uh if there's any kind of paint imperfections at all in the car look along the sides Looks really good, ding dent dents on the side. I don't really see any, so it looks good. 
All right. Check in misalignments or anything. No, oh, a little scrape here kind of thing. It's got, a, it's, got, it's got a few small little dings, but nothing dramatic. be a great car for driving to Mount Hood, the coast, all through the Oregon region. You'll be able to conquer snow when you need to, uh, but it doesn't really snow too often in Eugene and Portland, but uh, yeah, it looks really good. Um, no complaints with this car. The SE model is definitely more attractive trim level, more aggressive, really nice, really nice, really nice vehicle, so all right.